Mike Trout, Jose Altuve a tier of their own in fantasy baseball. Much of the USA may be covered in a frigid deep freeze, but that won't prevent fantasy baseball owners from thinking warm thoughts about spring training and draft day. In fact, the first official industry draft has already begun as the Fantasy Sports Trade Association League kicked things off in advance of its annual winter conference. This year, the league has expanded from 13 to 14 teams. And the participants first had a random draw to select their draft positions. As so often happens, the first two picks in the slotting draft selected the first two picks in the actual draft. But here's where this season might break from tradition. While Mike Trout and Jose Altuve seem to be the lead pipe locks as the first players drafted, there's very little consensus on the rest of the first round order. As a result, Ray Flowers of GuruElite.com and Sirius XM Fantasy Sports Radio took the number 12 draft spot with the third selection. Also, breaking with tradition, the league kicked off the draft online in advance of the annual FSTA Winter Conference. Here's how the entire first round unfolded. 2018 FSTA Experts Draft, Round 1-1. Of Mike Trout, Jim Bowden, Sirius XM Fantasy Baseball 2. 2B Jose Altuve, Steve Gardner, Howard Common, USA Today Sports 3. 3 Benola Renato charlie Wigert, Vlad Sedler, Gdm Sports 4. 1B Paul Goldschmidt Raffrabe, Roto Baller 5. SS Street Turner Derek Van Riper, Roto Wire 6. Of Bryce Harper, Greg Ambrosius, Tom Kasanick, and FBC 7. 3B Chris Bryant, Anthony Purry, Fantastics 8. Of Mucky Betts Dr. Roto Mark Bloom, Scout Fantasy 9. Of Charlie Blackman Brent Hershey, Ray Murphy, Baseball HQ 10. Of Giancarlo Stanton, Jeff Manns, Ted Schuster, Guru Elite 11. SS Carlos Correa Howard Bender, Fantasy Alarm 12. 1B Joey Votto Ray Flowers, Sirius XM Fantasy Drive 13. SP Clayton Kershaw, Lawrence Michaels Creative Sports 2.com 14. SP Max Scherzer, Glenn Colton, Rick Wolf, Stacy Stern. Sirius XM Colton and the Wolfman Any early analysis of the draft so far should probably include the team's second-round picks. For instance, Team Colton and the Wolfman doubled up on pitchers by taking Corey Kluber with the first pick of round two, giving them a deadly combo of top-end starters, but leaving them some serious work to do in building their offense. That brings up one of the most interesting things about 2018 drafts. How will owners value starting pitching? For the first time ever in the non-strike season, no pitcher last year threw more than 215 innings. Sale led with 214 and one-third. With starting pitchers working less deep into games, will the best ones now be worth more in relation to the average starter? Should there be a premium placed on starters who don't need as many innings to rack up high strikeout totals? In addition to Kluber, Three other ace starting pitchers, Sale, Steven Strasburg and Madison Bumgarner, were taken in the second round. Perhaps the end of the initial top tier. Building around all two of our USA Today sports team was extremely pleased to get the number two draft slot and take all two of, the reigning LMVP, with our first pick. All two of, like Trout, gives a fantasy team a tremendously solid base of stats to build upon. He led the majors last season with a .346 average, in addition to stealing 32 bases, scoring 112 runs and hitting 24 homers for the World Series champion Houston Astros. We back that up with Los Angeles Dodgers first baseman, outfielder Cody Bellinger with our second pick, 27th overall, to give us some power we passed up by opting for all two Vover or Renato, Goldschmidt or Stanton. That's a pretty solid all-around base. So it was important not to be caught without an ace starting pitcher before our next selection at number 55. We opted for the stability of Zach Grank over either New York Mets starters, Jacob deGrom, Noah Syndergaard, or high upside Carlos Carrasco. Sure enough, all of them, plus Justin Verlander and closer Kenley Jansen, were gone when it was time to pick in round four.